YouTube. Um, it's Saturday morning, Saturday, June 17th, 18th, 19th, something like that. And I did some laundry last night and now I'm up folding everything. And the way I do laundry and folding, I do the laundry, I fold everyone else's stuff and then I save the baby stuff for last. So I fold all everyone else's items and then I have a, you know, I put all the baby stuff to the side in a big pile. I sit down and I get comfy and this is kind of fun for me, uh, going through and folding the baby stuff, especially when I have new items. And in going through everything today, I realized that this was quite a great week for accessories for the babies. So I just want to go over most of the accessories that I got this week. Um, and these are all thrift items. So starting off first with this, uh, <clears throat> with this, it is, um, Cabbage Patch Kids, so it has different Cabbage Patch Babies on there. And here it actually says Cabbage Patch Kids. The stamp here says 1983, which was a wonderful, marvel marvelous, fantastic year, by the way. <laughs> I was born in 1983. Um, and it has just the babies and the balloons on there. And when I saw it in the store, it was folded like this and it had these little tassels. I thought it was a changing pad. So I opened it up like this and I said, oh, okay, changing pad. When I got home, I realized it doesn't open all the way. It's like sewn together. So you have like a little pocket here. So yes, I could still use this like this as a changing pad, or I can actually snuggle a baby up in there, um, you know, nice and comfy. But yeah, I thought this was a cute buy. It was, uh, I believe, ninety cents or a dollar ninety. I don't recall exactly. But um, so here's my Cabbage Patch Kid thing. I'll figure out what to do with that later. And then I have, <clears throat> excuse me, I have shoes. So I have these pair of Koala Baby shoes, um, size one. And I just washed them. I didn't know if they were supposed to be white or like a tan color. I just washed them in with my white load with bleach and they came out looking pretty much the same. Um, and as you can see, if you compare it to something that's actually white, this is a little bit off. But I think now that they've been washed and everything, I guess they're supposed to be um, that kind of off-white color. So I've been wanting sandals for the baby. So there's one pair. Here's another pair. <clears throat> Just some nice sandals for the girls. They're a size one. I know they'll fit Misty. Um, they might not fit some of the other girls. They might be too big, but we'll see. And these are just nice and simple. Simple white sandals. Um, here I can picture these on Jamilin. Just some brown. Also, actually, quite a few of these are koala babies. These are koala babies as well. Uh, size one, the old man sandal. And like I said, all these just came out the wash. I wash my little things in these little uh, delicate bags. So like their shoes and any of the crocheted items I get or knit items, I wash them in these. So I just washed them, you know, I had a separate one for the whites, and then I had one for the darks, and they came out just fine. Um, so here are the sandals, which really I purchased for Jamilin. I can just see him in these. I might put him in these today. Uh, these I got, these are size newborn, Carter size newborn. These were 90 cents with 30% off, and they still had the tag on them. They still had the plastic thing in the back with the hook on it. They're from Target, I believe. Um, and they were 90, you know, I only paid 60 cents for them. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, very good buy here. These little sandals, these are from Payless. They're the Tiny Toe, Teeny Toes brand, size one. And I can just see Misty wearing these. They um pretty much go with anything. You know, all the basic colors for little girls in the summer are on these. And they, I like them. They have like a nice rubber sole. So they're pretty cool. My daughter didn't get these little sandals because she was born in September. So right after she was born, I don't really 
put sandals on real babies. So she didn't wear sandals until the following summer. So she never got these itty bitty sandals. Um, then I saw these Old Navy shoes. I think these will only fit Misty, but they were too cute to pass up. And these were also still new. It still had the elastic and tag on the back. And they're like a dark pink, with like a fuchsia color with ruffles. Purple, fuchsia, and lilac colored ruffles on there with a little... What's that? Um, what's this called? I can't remember right now, but the little weave going around, and those are adorable. And I have wanted some black patent leather shoes for the girls for a while, and I found these um, yesterday. And they're just a simple shoe, but they're so adorable to me. I love them. And then I got this hat. This hat is from Babies R Us. It also had the tag. I mean, I got it in the thrift store, but it still had the tag on it from Babies R Us. And I all, you know, and once I walked up to it and saw it, I already had the outfit planned out in my head. And I just picked up these little shoes as well. So stay tuned for that outfit in the video soon. Because I think that's so cute. And I think that's really it for what I have right here. I did get some more uh, scratch mittens. And that's it for the new stuff from new accessories for right now. These are just the ones that I just happened to look down as I was folding up the laundry and like, hey, they got quite a few good thing, good accessories this week. So, all right, YouTube. Um... Stay tuned. I do plan to film another video tomorrow, which will be Sunday. Um, but I'll see you then. Bye.